Hey lovelies, it's Crystal. I'm back with another look for the Smoky Eye series collaboration that I'm doing with Shay Shay Sweetie 04. And uh, again, her name is Shannon. So we decided to do a fall smoky eye. And this is the look that I came up with today. So it's like orange, bronze, um, a little bit of a violet shade in the crease and uh, just smoked it out on the outer corner with some black eyeshadow so this is what I came up with uh, you could make it a little more intense by putting like black eyeliner on the waterline but I haven't really been doing that too much lately this is what I came up with for my fall smoky eye Shay Shay Sweetie 04 look is right here And if you guys want to watch her tutorial on her fall smoky eye, then just uh, check down in the description box, the information box below. Um, I will put the link to her video down there. You can also find hers as a video response below. So, so if you want to know how to get this fall smoky eye, then just keep on watching. applied my eye primer I use my Urban Decay primer potion in Eden. I'm gonna go in with my Ulta eyeshadow in Naked. It's just an off-white matte shadow and I'm just gonna put this under my eyebrow as my highlight color. So I'm going to go in with my MAC shadow. This one is called Hux, I believe that's how you pronounce it. And um, I depotted mine, so I have a label on the back. Hux, and it's a satin finish. I'm going to go in with my Sigma Tapered Blending E35. Looks like that. I'm just going to pop this right into the crease. Go on with this MAC eyeshadow and it's called Rule and it's a matte finish. It's just like an orangey, nice autumn fall color. I'm just going to take a flat shader brush and I'm just going to pop this right in the center of the eyelid. I'm going to go in with this MAC shadow and it's called Bronze and it is a frost. I'm just going to go in with a flat, a smaller shader brush. And I'm just going to pop this right into the inner lid and the outer lid. Going back in with the rule color, orange color, I'm just going to touch that up, blend between the bronze and the rule. So I'm going to go in with this MAC shadow, and this one is called Star Violet, and it's a Velux Pearl finish. And I'm just going to take an angled eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to pop this right into the crease. Taking the more pointy edge, that part will be in going into the crease area.
I'm just going to touch up the bronze a little bit. And I'm going to go back in with Rule. Just touch that up. I'm going to go back in with Hawks, the original crease color, and I'm just going to blend everything out kind of with this color. You know, it looks really messy right now, but we're going to blend everything out even more in a minute. So I don't have Max Carbon Black, so I'm just going to go in with my L'Oreal infinite wear infinite eyeshadow um this is from their older packaging and this one is just called lush raven and it's just a black matte eyeshadow so take any black that you have i'm just going to take this contour slash crease brush and i'm just going to pop this right onto the outer corner just to deepen it up and smoke it out since this is a fall smoky eye i want to smoke it out on the outer corners I'm going to go in a circular motion to get all the product off the brush and then kind of sweep it inward. I'm going to go back in with the bronze to kind of blend out just this little part here. I'm going to go um, in with the same black and I'm just going to apply some to the lower lash line with a pencil brush. I'm going to kind of smudge it out with my finger. So I'm just going to take the brush that I use for my highlight color and I'm just going to blend out the upper edge here. Just taking that angled brush, I'm going to go back in with um, Violet Star, but not adding any more product to the brush, just going in and kind of blending out everything. In with Hux. Hux. <laughs> I'm just gonna blend with that again. I'm gonna go back in with Ulta's Naked Eyeshadow and just apply a little bit more as my highlight and help blend everything out. So, um, I forgot to hit record and I just went in with my Sonia Kashuk gel liner. This one is in ebony. And it's just a black gel eyeliner. I really, really like this gel liner. Anyway, I apply that to the upper lash line. Sorry, I forgot to hit record, so you can just see me doing the very last part of it. And I'm going to curl my lashes. Before I put the mascara on, I'm just going to put some of this Ulta Naked eyeshadow right into the inner corner. And also a little bit along the like bottom edge of the black eyeliner or eyeshadow on the lash line just to smooth it out a little bit. I'm going to go in with my Rimmel Lash Accelerator Mascara in Extreme Black. And this is what the wand looks like. I absolutely love this mascara.
for the face and lips, I am going to go in with my Physicians Formula Healthy Wear SPF 50 Bronzer in Fair. And this is what it looks like. It's just a really light bronzer. Suits my skin tone well. I'm going to go in with my Equal Tools bronzer brush. I'm just going to just apply it to the cheeks and it's kind of like almost like contouring with it but not quite as defined as a contour. So I'll be using a smaller brush for that. with my Too Faced Papa Don't Peach blush. Love this blush. I love the color. So this is, it's like a, has a bit of a sheen to it. It's a peachy color. Love it. Just going to go in using my e.l.f. blush brush. I'm going to take my e.l.f. powder brush and just kind of blend everything in, the bronzer and the blush. And I'm just going to go back over the blush a little bit. go in with my Rimmel London 1000 Kisses Tiramisu Lip Liner and it's just a nude liner. CoverGirl Lip Perfection Lipstick and this one's in Delight. And it's like a peachy nude. Yeah, this is it. This is the final look. I hope you guys like it. And thanks so much for watching. Bye.